Hello and welcome to Bell's Lighthouse. My name is, of course, Andy. I wasn't really expecting to do a video today. I was happy to just sit around in my pajamas and do nothing. However, postman's been, and you know what that means. Actually, it could mean several things. But, as it's the postman, that means it's time for Poke Pen Pals with a wonderful package here from the wonderful Professor Cheney. Thank you very much, Shenin. Um, We've, we've been trying to do this for the longest, longest time. Um, I think I went to send her a box just before Christmas. It came back. Uh, much like the Moist Muck one, but in reverse. So, <laughs> yeah, it's been a while that we've been trying to sort this one out. It's finally got here. We finally managed to figure it out. Obviously, I've done the, my, my usual thing of putting Pokemon cards on top to hide any kind of addresses. Um... I really don't know what to make of this one already as we begin because it's a fairly sizable box um, and it feels quite heavy as well so I really don't know what you put in here. Um, the the other... Oh, I can probably just open it from the side. No, I need to open it from the top because I, I can hear things. So I'm just going to take it away just so I can cut into it. Um, yeah, so we've, we've here are these little boxes um, and I'm... <laughs> I mean, okay, like, as I've opened the box, well, there's my address, I'll try and blow that out. So as you can see from the front, oh, she sent me an Elite Trainer box, no she hasn't, um, I'm going to try and, I'm going to lean this over to a side, and, uh, hang on, I'm going to just put a card on the bottom, just in case my address pops back up, um, so yeah, let's just start digging through this, oh my goodness, okay. Just, there's a lot of things going on. Obviously, this is just the uh, breakthrough Elite Trainer Box thing. But I do like the art in those. I'm sure I've got some about otherwise. Um, oh, there's a note. There's a note. Oh, thank goodness there's a note. What is happening? There's just so many things. What? Cheney, you're a madman. Oh. And a lovely. Oh, this must. Be, this was from the uh, tins. Oh my goodness! It, oh. Okay. Hello, Andy. I hope you enjoy the Pokemon goodies. A mix of newer stuff, old vintage stuff I had laying around, and some stuff from the Japanese anime theme store near where I spent some time over the Christmas holidays. It is a store full of goodies. Anyway, it's been great to get to know you a bit over the past year. Your channel is super fun to watch, especially Lucky Dip and your Glissapod plushy. I'm glad we got to do Pokemon. Sorry it took me so long to get the box ready for you. Hopefully it was worth the wait. Anyway, thanks again. Hope you enjoy it. Let me know if you want to do a pack battle or something in the future. Best wishes. Um, where is he? As you mentioned, Glissapod. I've even put a bow tie on, on him for the occasion. So he can just sort of sit in the corner being fancy. There we go. Fancy, definitely. And then there are some lovely Pokemon pictures on the bottom. Bulbasaur, Ponyta, Cutie Fly, and a Porygon Z. Beautiful. Um, I'm going to put this just to a side because <laughs> there's like so many different little th things wrapped up in here. I really don't know where to sort of begin. Okay, so just literally going to go from the top. I can definitely see some McDonald's toys, I think. Uh, that can go there. Okay, that's just some sleeves. That's what nice I like those sleeves so we have some of the tops cards you know what as fun as it is I have one I'm not gonna show it just yet so from the first movie leaving the nest very nice Mewtwo one excellent squad squad also there's a the camera there's me very shiny all parts from the anime that's uh, Cassidy yeah and a Nido King very cool I like them um, Funnily enough, I actually bought this one not too long ago, Mystery at the Lighthouse, because of course I did. <laughs> and then the sleeves that we got, Ultra Ball, Blue, I suppose that's meant to be a Great Wall maybe, and Pokemon ones. Like them, I do, I say I like sleeves, I obviously have some different sleeves that I've sort of collected and whatnot. Um, whenever anyone sends me like a card in a fancy sleeve, I try to keep that sleeve. Maybe I put an energy card and that goes into a binder. So almost like a signature card. 
I have signature sleeves from people. And speaking of signature cards, there is one here on the front. I'm going to put... okay. So there is Professor Cheney's Bulbasaur. I'm sure it does lots of damage. Oh, and a cute Pikachu uh, sleeve as well. So that's what I mean. So th ones like that, they'll get put into their own like little sleeve. I was going to try and put that to a side, but I mean, I've already seen it. But <laughs> so we have Megaton. Oh, I, I'm trying to think what set this is. I've opened this. Is this Stormfront? I'm going to look up. Oh, no, this was just Diamond and Pearl uh, base set then. So we Megaton, Primplup, Boisel, Goldeen, Hoot Hoot. Magnemite plus power energy search some old energies fantastic hey, an ultra ball rock rough dark energy a hollow a reverse hollow builds maintenance a floats all there I reckon that's a very special one to show in considering she put that in a uh, top load up but now that's funny because I can't think where I've put it in my pile of stuff. I found it in my pile of stuff. So, that Volcan. Yeah, he's Volcan. <laughs> For some reason, I've always done that where I've said uh, Volcarona. But yeah, so, send me the lovely Volcanion EX full art from Steam Siege. I think I said this in a video when I opened up the Pikachu ball, Pikachu and Eevee ball collection thing. I bought my own one, so I've got two, <laughs> so that's wonderful. No, I mean, I'm obviously very happy, I'm not being, like, funny with it, but... Yeah, so I've now got two of those beautiful full arts. Lots of cards, lots of... just a lot of, a lot of things. And we have some McDonald's toys. I didn't get to really go... I managed to buy one, or two, no, I did get two, and I got the same toy, so... There is uh, Laddie S, fantastic. From up here, let's see what the card is inside because that's the main one. A hey, Magnemite, very cool. Um, you know, I'll keep that cardboard somewhere because I'll probably need that one. Fling that over there. Uh, these, okay. So I just want to pick one up. I'm fairly sure that's a Burger King toy. Uh, Ladios, Ladia, sorry. So they can sit up there. And let's check out the card. Oh, Psyduck, very close. Very nearly, nearly. We, I'm looking for that Porygon, of course. Oh, we, of course, uh, speaking of Porygon, then the last one in the back was the one from... Uh, well, it was actually just a promo, but... God, it's really shiny. And that's in fantastic condition as well. Thank you very much for that. Crikey. I'm, I'm seriously running out of space. How can I do that? Uh, let's do it this way, maybe. Yeah. So yeah, I'm fairly sure this was a Burger King toy. Yep. There it is on the bottom. I don't know if you can do this. Focus, hello. Yeah, Burger King. And, I mean, I'm going to keep that in the plastic for now, because that's pretty cool. Um, Rapidash, Ponytar, one of my favourite Pokemon, along with, obviously, Porygon. Basically any Pokemon with a P in the name, uh, I'm a fan of the Poliwhirl line. There's just so much, oh my god. I feel like this, how much was this? <laughs> I'm going to take that price tag off, because I imagine you probably forgot to do that. <laughs> so I know how much uh, this was. <laughs> Is that, oh okay, I thought that was a really old... Um, but in this little bundle of goodness, we've got... Oh, a Toys of Us promo! Hell yeah! So, again, a little Rapidash toy. I don't know how that's meant to stand up, because there's no, like, stand to it, and it's just on one leg. Let's put that there. This is a nice Brendan. Is this from... I feel like this is from the... Uh... The TFG, the trading figure game. I'm fairly sure this guy was. And the way it makes you think that is that it's almost like they've ripped him off the bottom, like the actual spinning bit. So, and I'm sure I've seen that. 
Now I have no idea what these are. Are these just cards? Are these stickers? I think they're just cards, but I'm sure I can start you. Very cool. Some more stickers. Machop, Electabuzz, and Golduck. Toys R Us promo. Excellent. I'm going to keep... Because there are... I can see other... I can see other packs. I'm going to save that till last. Uh, this... It was Crimson Invasion. I can't think of what it was called in Japanese. Uh, Awakened Heroes. That's the one. That was pretty quick. So we're Generations and an Evolution. So I'm picking those packs up. Had some luck actually last time somebody sent me some. Sent me some uh, things. So a whole bunch of coins and. Looks like key rings? Or keychains? So let's get the coins quickly. Goltal, Deoxys, Koga. And grab them. In their primal forms? Maybe Kyoga. Anyway, coins, I like coins. Um, Oh, hell yeah, and I do like pins as well, I'm, I'm dropping everything. So, <laughs> Mega Venusaur, that can go in... I need to find a good way, I need like a cork board or something to put all my pins. If I put them over here, you can kind of see that. And then this is just adorable. All the starters, or all the original starters on a nice little key ring. You'll hear me coming, definitely, if I put that on. Um, are these... these are sleeves. These are sleeves. That is incredible. I have never seen these sleeves before. Fantastic art. With the uh, plus or minus. I'm trying to think. Oh, yeah, there's Jirachi right at the top there. Is that Jirachi? No. What the fuck is that? I can't tell. <laughs> my eyes are my eyesight's going funny. But that's. They're incredible. They're fun old sleeves. Now, here's kind of like where it's getting a bit uh, just crazy. So, so we've had all those. We've had all those cards. Like this is has honestly been a, a, just a nuts um, opening, but it isn't over yet. Just so we've got this bundle of cards. See, there's quite a few there. This bundle of cards. This bundle of cards. This bundle. This bundle. <laughs> Shannon, what are you doing to me? Seriously! <laughs> um, right, okay, no, uh, I need my sleeves still rolled up. And obviously on the front of this one is Bill. There's some sleeved cards in it. Ay, 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 ay. I like that they're in, obviously, one of these things, and then they're still, like, all bundled together. So... Some bills, fantastic. There's just one. Baby Search, we don't like her because, you know, Bill was the only one that dealt with the computer system. More professors, professors. I, I, and that's another one. I really like my professors. Professor Rowan, Juniper, Random Receiver, Sycamore. That is a base set Porygon. Incredible. Um, Ancient Origins, Porygon 2, I can't think. <laughs> See, you really have just taken the. Uh, Oh, that's a lovely one from the Generations. Oh, okay, I didn't realise there was one in Generations. Switch! Hell yeah! My favorite, one of my favourite random cards, Mewtwo Spirit Link. Mewtwo from Evolutions, Mewtwo EX from Evolutions. Ooh, wow! Okay, it sounds silly just to get so excited over an energy card. And oh, okay, there was just a smudge on the, the back here. But I know, again, energy cards I love. Interviews question. Oh, a copycat. Now that's fantastic. I actually have a couple of those myself. Um, so they'll go nicely with that Sage Train rival. I think that's now quite clearly you, Shannon. You are now my rival. Cheerleaders cheer. Mars. <laughs> my Clefairy doll. Isn't that his base set? Yeah. A first edition. Coughing, wow, uh, from Team Rocket. Holland's cast form. See, again, this was. I've sort of spoken about it before when certain sets I kind of skipped on and whatnot, but yeah, the Holland stuff was one I skipped out on, so I'll 
Ashy's Pikachu from the promo. Reverse Nidoking. Oh, a, a Team Aqua's Muck. That's really cool because I've got a Team Aqua page in my binder. And the Giratina promo. I think I um, won this off a giveaway from her. And uh, she put it into the thing here. Crikey. Okay. Still more to go. I might try and speed run some of these because I feel like we're uh, dragging on time. I don't want to be too boring. Just going through and going, wow, 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 but some fantastic base set stuff. Oh my goodness. And and these are all in such good condition too. You know, tiny bits of whitening, but this is mind-bending. I honestly think my package now has just been drastically, drastically overshadowed by all this. They're in serious, like... Far better than the ones I had. I'm fairly sure they just ended up in like a uh, in a box somewhere that just kind of got rattled around and battered, and they all have just terrible whitening on. Oh my goodness! Just to go through a lot of these double colors. Hell yeah! It's fantastic. Old. It's such a nostalgic feeling to go through these. Awesome e-reader stuff, like I was saying about the Holland stuff, oh I didn't really do much with that. But then again the E stuff I missed out on a lot of. Makahida, Shroomish, I do like Shroomish, Shroomish is a good one. Taylo, oh. Pokeball, Energy Slits, I have this but not obviously in the e-reader stuff. And I really like that Pokeball one as well, like the, um, just the art and it's very simple but very, very nice. Obviously it's a classic sign, the Pokeball. Potion, Energy, Energy, Energy. Wow, okay, um, and we're still not through yet. Next big one. Um, I can't remember if I've told her that I was collecting jungle and fossil stuff, so... Uh, oh no. <laughs> so these will probably... Th this will probably finish off a lot of what I've got uh, I need in terms of my collection now. Like again, I've probably got <laughs> jungle and fossil stuff all sitting around somewhere in a box but I haven't found them yet so I'm not too sure I felt really thick no, okay. but again these are in incredible condition see there's fossil oh. I think you, you've taken quite to, like my wants or anything that I was after to the most literal point I do love that Psyduck as well, which is like looking at himself. Ah, there we go, there's the uh, Lonely Slowpoke. Mr. Fuji. I sound stuff, but I'm fairly sure that was one that I definitely needed. Zangus! Oh my goodness, so Zangus is another one of my favourite Pokemon. Um, I just really like normal types as well. Uh, beautiful old Marie, that's from Call of Legends. Yeah, they both are. Relicant, <laughs> that's a really nice one. Vulpix, Darkness Energy and Metal Energy when there were sort of special energy cards. <sighs> okay. The... I say lesser... The not as big <laughs> final one. Okay, so we have a Fossil Egg. Oh, this is from Neo. Uh, what is it? Neo what? I can never remember the quality. This is Discovery. Okay, Neo Discovery. Wow. Okay, um, I'm not sure you should have put that one. Hippopotas from Breakthrough. Go let. That is incredible. I love that one. That Electric is, is phenomenal. Real lovely artwork. We can have another look at him. Beautiful colours as well. Magic Up. Reverse. Freezing. Gibble. Hooper, have some donuts. I kind of want some donuts now. And Entei GX! Of all the GXs, of course it was going to be him <laughs> to come back and uh, say hello. Final one of the mystery bundles. Don't know where that's gone. Swablu. Get another fossil. Basculin. From Black and White Base. Very nice. Love seeing them older ones. Dragonair. I think that was one I kind of wanted to maybe try and do something with. Marsh up another E card, Diggersby, Fletchling, hey, and uh, I dragon from the Jelly Bean dimension. So, like I said, we're still not through. We have 
three packs. You know, I'm gonna open up the Japanese one first. Uh, and you know what? Because it's been so nostalgic, we'll do Evolutions last. I was gonna say oh, uh, newest to oldest, but Generations technically came out before um, Evolution. So, Crawdon, Salandit, Alolan Golem, Remoraid, and uh, Fighting Memory. Okay. <laughs> Fighting Memory. I can quite tell what the colour was on that one. So we have a Generations, obviously there's no code to give away, and even if there is, you ain't getting it. <laughs> so, Doe Duo. I did recently finish up my collection of Generations, so this might have come a little bit too late, but I still very much like it, obviously that's one of the ones I have. Emma Cooney, hell yeah. One for the funny old ones. A Doug Trio, Meowstic, oh, the reverse one, and a regular rare, Gyarados. Now, it all comes down to this evolution spec, whether or not this whole opening was worth it. <laughs> Obviously, I'm kidding. There's been loads of just incredible stuff. I mean, I I don't think I can say thank you enough. You know what? You're not even going to get that code card because that's going to sit up here. You can't see it. You can't scan it. <laughs> so, <laughs> Ponyta, Sandshrew, Vulpix, Nidoranmail. Growlith, a revive, Misty Determination. Oh, there is a secret rare, but obviously evolution secret rares are nothing! Because they're everywhere. Um, the executor, I need to say the lowly executor. Ah, uh, Charizard, Spirit Link, very nice. And, hey, Starmie. I mean, I like Starmie. I like that card, I did quite well with it when I did my Gold Duck Kingdra deck. If you haven't seen that, do check that out. That's a very old video of mine. One of my better ones, actually, that was uh, so well received. Uh, honestly, I'm just seriously blown away by this. This just sheer amount of generosity. Like, incredible. Just, I'm going to have a lot of, well, I say a lot of fun. I'm going to have a lot of time to go through all of these, sort them out, put them into the appropriate binders. But that has honestly been well. Just the sheer amount of just things. Like, it, if you just sent me the toys and a couple of cards, that'd have been cool, and that'd have been fine. But you sent all of these things, and just, wow. <laughs> Thank you so much, Chen. Obviously, for anyone who's watching that isn't Professor Chen, do check out her channel. She's a very, very sweet and wonderful YouTuber. Obviously, she's having a lot of Pokemon cards. Uh, I'm still looking forward to the next... Uh, nature adventure she goes on so so she does all sorts of different bits and pieces like that links and everything will be in the description you, you know this general kind of thing <laughs> but yeah I, I'm seriously just blown away by the, like I say the sheer amount of things and generosity you are incredible Jenny, thank you so so much I know Glissabod is a uh, very happy to. <laughs> anyway, that's going to do it for now. I know it's going to be been quite a long one, but we, we got there. Uh, I've been Andy from Bills Like Else. Thank you so much for watching. Remember, take care, and I'll see you all in the next video.